Okay, so now we're going to run through the instructions on how to go ahead and download and install Visual Studio. So the first part of this is we're going to go ahead and go to the Visual Studio Community Edition website and download the software. And once it's downloaded, we'll go ahead and select uh, to execute the, the downloaded package to begin the installation process. So the download is now completed, and I'm selecting to execute the uh, download package, which is VS Community in this case. So I'm going to go ahead and execute that, and right away Windows will then ask if I want to go ahead and execute that with a typical security warning for downloaded files. So in this piece, I'm going to go ahead and select the typical or default uh, installation and uh, select install and the installation process will begin at this point. And through the magic of video editing, uh, this process can actually be quite lengthy, so I've shortened it for this video. So it, it took me about 45 minutes for this to run on a fairly slow notebook computer. So um, once it finishes, though, it, it asks you to do a restart of the computer, which I've done here. And then I'll go ahead and select uh, Execute. We'll find Visual Studio uh, on the, the program menu. And when you first uh, bring it up, it asks you if you want to sign into Visual Studio online. I'll say not now. And the very first time you start Visual Studio, it'll ask you what settings you'd like to use. So I typically use the Visual C Sharp settings uh, for this. And we'll go ahead and start Visual Studio. Now, one thing that I did speed up through that process as well is you will see Visual Studio saying it'll take some time to, to set up for the uh, first time you start it up. It took a couple of minutes on my, my computer, which is a, a fairly slow computer. So I recommend you try to get the, as fast a machine as you can for this process and, uh, and, and try to work it out for the install. But uh, you can uh, run it on a little bit slower computer. You just need to be patient through the process. So. That's it really for installing Visual Studio. In the next lesson, we'll look at uh, writing a simple program uh, after we've downloaded and installed the package. Thank you.